this was me in the beginning of my weight loss journey my waistline was about 41 inches as you can see i purposely needed to document this because i knew i was going to be serious with my weight loss and this was just the um, free whatever of the tape roll and whenever it wasn't free it was just 40 and for my arms which is like the toughest place for me to lose weight it was um 15 inches so if you want to see how i looked like later on keep watching hi everyone welcome to my channel i am temi banjo and if it's your first time here welcome to my channel please do consider hitting the subscribe button also give this video a thumbs a thumbs up give this video a thumbs up and also remember to turn on your post notification so you do not forget or you do not miss what's what's going on so you do not miss any of my uploads and if it's not your first time here welcome back please give this video a thumbs up and let's just get right into today's video so at this point i just feel i have to be speaking very slowly because <laughs> It's like i'm just you know jamming my words together anyways today's video is a weight loss update on how i am doing as you can see i am well and fine but i'm here to give you guys my weight loss update how much i've lost and what and the things i did to you know lose the extra pounds so this period like this period of my weight loss i was really really serious with it i haven't been this serious since I think about a year ago when I first of all lost the whole weight and the first thing I did was to start with an with egg fast and because I know egg fast is zero carbs and it is really fast so my cousin and I decided to start egg fast and egg fast means you are not having any fat no carbs no sugar no source of energy at all so whatever energy your body is going to use is going to have to tap into the reserve it has which is the stored fat in your body to give you energy or to help you carry out your daily work so i was on egg fast for three days and the first day was hard af like i almost gave up but i knew what i was going after so i was able to do the egg fast for three days and after three days i switched over to um, a little bit of keto ish but i wasn't taking fat still because i know fat is the only source of energy and once you take fat in fat your body will not tap into your reserve and i needed my body to tap into my reserve like i had enough reserve in my body i had enough fat for my body to tap into so i wasn't still taking fat i was taking only five net carbs per day for about three more days this is still in the first week so i was taking about five net carbs per day and that was just protein vegetables and you know sausages i was just doing mostly protein and little vegetable no fat at all so in the second week when i felt that i could you know start taking fat because i was really really weak i was so sure i had reached ketosis you guys please my neighbor's generator is on so if you are hearing a noise or a sound just please ignore it <sighs> So I, my body was weak and I knew that I needed to take in fat so that I would have enough energy. So I started taking fat and, and then I reduced my carbs to very, very low amount, which was about two net carbs. I was not really taking vegetable. Any carb I was taking was just from maybe the ingredients I was using to cook or the things I was using to prepare my food. I was not consciously taking vegetables, which my... Um, which my carbohydrates would have come from so i was taking more fat low carbohydrates and you know moderate protein also the period when i was eating when i was doing the egg fast like the whole first week that whole first week i was doing omad i was doing intermittent fasting all at the same time so omad means um one meal a day whereby you eat only one meal a day and if you are not familiar with these terms of weight loss i have a video here where you can you know educate yourself about the terms of weight loss and the perfect weight loss for your body type i'll leave a card here so please do check it out and i was doing omad and i was doing intermittent fasting for about 10 days i was eating once a day and it was kind of uncomfortable at the beginning but after some time i you know got used to it i'll usually have like four eggs and that was it for the day i'll have coffee throughout that day so coffee was like if it was my next source of energy which was keeping me sane and after some time i switched to bulletproof coffee and finally i eventually switched to keto like full-blown keto whereby i was eating high fat 
um, I was eating food or my diet was majorly high fat low carb and moderate protein and as you all know you guys were seeing my meals i made videos about them and if you haven't seen the my most recent video of keto i'm going to leave a card here again so you can check that out also you do want to follow my instagram because i always post my meals on my instagram and some of my meals that don't make it here are always on my stories and they are permanently on, they are permanently on my stories because i have created two dedicated highlights to show my food and everything i eat so if you miss them on my story just make sure you check my highlight on instagram i'm going to leave my instagram on the screen here so you like you can check it out okay i just want to say the only reason why i was able to attain this was because i was gold driven like i was really really determined to lose that weight this happened just after the whole end SARS protest which made everybody really really sad like everybody was in a bad place we all know what happened which I will not go into details in which I will not go into details into it into in in we all know what happened anyways and also i lost my instagram account at that point my screen was broken my phone screen was broken so many things were happening to me so i was kind of feeling bad i wasn't depressed i was just sad and i was emotionally eating i was doing things that i would normally not do and i was just in a bad place basically but now i'm fine i'm better you know i need to get myself back together which i am already so right now i'm on a low carb diet and my most recent video on a low carb diet what i eat and how i you know keep trim and fit is going to be here in the card so make sure you do check that out also so make sure you do check that out and that's which that is pretty much what happened what i did to so lose weight go back in shape and hopefully like that was the most interesting keto i've ever done i don't know how it happened but it was really interesting so hopefully i'll be back on keto sometime soon i really want to go back on the keto diet before the festive season is full blown because i know i'm going to be eating a lot and i just and i don't just want to start eating just like that i want to you know be trained somehow somehow some way so that i can catch somebody's son's eye just kidding hopefully if i go back on the keto diet i'll definitely share my meals with you guys as you guys have been requesting that i do what i eat in a week which <laughs> which feels like a whole lot of work but hopefully i'll be able to you know pull that together all right so this is me after five weeks of keto omad intermittent fasting egg fast carnivore and <laughs> whatever you can think of i did everything and my waistline was down to 36 inches which means i lost um 40 inches of my weight or of my waist and when the tape rule was free it was 37 inches so roughly four inches and like i said earlier my arm is always the toughest part for me to lose so that was like 14 point five inches and whenever i gain weight that is where the weight goes to first so this is what my whole body looks like my f um the back row extra tire is gone almost disappeared i mean just remaining a little so this is my waistline my tummy i do have a little bit of fupa left which i think exercise will be able to get rid of and also this extra breast <laughs> because that's what i think that's what i think they call it i would like to get rid of that also there's still a little bit of fat in my stomach i won't lie to you guys but hopefully exercise will make me toned and you know make my skin tighten up a little bit more so everything is going to be fine when i start exercising hopefully so yeah this is what my body looks like i am extremely happy i'm thankful for my results so make sure you give this a try and let me know how it works out for you guys and we've pretty much come to the end of this video so if it's your first time here and you made it up to this point and you haven't hit the subscribe button kindly hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell give this video a thumbs up and if you're a returning subscriber and you haven't given this video a thumbs up please give it a thumbs up it's just the like button that's somewhere down here give this video a thumbs up and i hope to see you in my next video you're about to check out which means you are sticking around with me so let's go and i'll see you in my next video you're about to check out okay let's go